sound of traffic in a bustling city. Isn't it noisy? But there's a Takumiu innovator we're going to meet today who has developed something that will solve the noise pollution. Let's go and meet him. Atsuki City in Kanagawa Prefecture is a commuter town near Tokyo. The manufacturer I'll visit today makes products which utilizes their soundproofing technology. Hello, I'm Michelle. Nice to meet you. I'm Take. Today's Takumi is Koichi Take. He created an innovative acoustic panel. The Takumi took us to see a box. This box is made from the Takumi's panels. Let's see what this box is capable of. Oh. <laughs> it's so loud! My goodness! It's so quiet now! What a difference! Wow! Let's try measuring the difference. The alarm is very loud, with the sound reaching about 92 decibels. But when it's placed inside the box, it's about 55 decibels. This is a level of a quiet office. To the human ear, it's only one ten thousandth as loud as without the box. How is this technology different from other panels? To the left is a conventional panel made out of fibers. To the right is the Takumi's acoustic panel. It can reduce around 15 to 20 decibels more than conventional panels, although it is only one-third the thickness. Try holding it. Wow, it's very light. I thought a panel of this size would be heavier, but it's unbelievable. The Takumi's lightweight, high-performance acoustic panels are used in places where sound can be a big problem. Noise can be reduced just by boxing in the source without the hassle of renovation. This is an acoustic box for a 3D printer. The sound of this printer running 24-7 was problematic, so the office installed the acoustic box. The panel can also be used outdoors. At this factory, they were getting complaints about the noise of this blower. Once the soundproofing panels were installed, the noise drastically decreased. The panels can also be installed on highways. They are used for absorbing noise from bridge joints. The Takumi's panels provide solutions for various situations. The secret behind the Takumi's acoustic panel is its structure. Sound is first absorbed by aluminum fibers on the surface. Following that, Layers of resin foam and core material trap more sound. Finally, an aluminum sheet will contain any unabsorbed sound, creating a three-layered structure. The Takumi's resin foam is made with a special combination of materials. The foam has a fine tubular structure, which effectively absorbs the sound. Let's look into the mechanism. The energy of the sound first collides with aluminum fiber, where a portion is transformed into thermal energy. Resin foams then capture any sound that passed through the first layer. As the sound passes through the maze-like structure of the foam, the energy weakens and turns into heat by colliding with the walls. At the same time, the core material also turns sound into heat. Any sound which reaches the aluminum sheet bounces back inwards and converts into heat. There's yet another secret behind this acoustic panel. The core material has a honeycomb structure which strengthens the panel. In fact, this company originally manufactured flooring materials for the Shinkansen bullet trains. When the Takumi began to develop a durable, lightweight, soundproofing panel, he realized that he could apply the honeycomb structure that was used for the bullet train. This is quite durable. <laughs> but isn't it basically paper? 
Is it really strong? Stronger than it looks. Can you try standing on it? On this? Wow. It's really sturdy. And very stable. The honeycomb material is versatile because of its durability. After 10 years of trial and error, the Takumi finally developed this high-performance acoustic panel. What kind of product would people benefit from? I'm constantly pursuing an answer to this question. And then I develop the product, which is how I hope to be making a contribution to society. And today I brought some panels with me. Let's see. Oh yes, this is very light. It would be easy for anybody to set this up. Yes, and this acoustic panel can also reduce echo, so it's used on the walls of recording studios too. Oh yes, of course. And right now the Takumi's panels are gaining attention for their ability to absorb low frequency waves too. Low frequency noise generated by wind plants has become a health hazard, and it's said to be difficult to block the sound. Yes, however, these panels were proven to be effective through an animal experiment at Nagoya University. That's outstanding. This will be a solution for many different situations. Yes, and the 78-year-old Takumi believes he is in his prime and is excited about inventing his next product. I think it's very admirable. It sure is. Thank you very much, Michelle. So, Dr. Oka, how would you wrap up today's program? I can see the logic to draw an analogy between the Sea of Japan and a miniature ocean. Understanding the mechanisms of the smaller body of water to help explain the world's phenomena on fast forward. I think that idea was very unique. And that's it for this week's Science View. Thank you for watching. And see you all next time. <laughs>